Call me Cat Communicate Season 2 Finale! Yeah! Two legit stories, alright? Talagang, talagang dalawang story na siya. So, first story was yung... Uh, what, what the Japanese call White Day. Tadano was actually racking his brain as to um, how he's going to give his to Komi. Kasi nga, binigyan nga siya ng chocolates, di ba? Kilig nga yun eh, di ba? Now, she, uh, he sought uh, his younger sister's, sister self, si Hitomi. Eh, sinabi nila ni Hitomi na, Come on! Who do you like? So, tinapatan na siya. Oh, in a way, sinabi niya, Yeah, si Komi. The day came. It's white day na. Everybody has um, given back to those uh, who, have, who have given to them on Valentine's. Except him. <laughs> Hiyang hiya pa siya. So, now, he has no choice but to give his gift to Komi sa bahay niya. Mm. So, nag-iintay siya sa kwarto ni sa kwarto ni Komi. Ngayon naman, ang, ang pumasok, yung erpa. Okay, yung uh, the father who is uh, who's as equally silent as the daughter. <laughs> so, syempre, todo nervous na si todo nervous na si Tata no? because the man of the house has just uh, walked in to, um, to give him uh, to, uh, to at least talk to him while Uh, while his daughter is away. Then, eventually, Komi comes in to, uh, what? Sinabi na lang eh. What? Just, talagang, uh, she literally, um, uh, showed her own father the door. Talagang, tinutulog niya pabalabas yung tatay niya. So, pak. So, nakalabas na. And, tingin niya ngayon sa kwarto niya, ang dumi-dumi. So, biglang linis din siya. So, oh, okay. So she was able to sit down with uh with Tadano. Ito naman si Tadano. Uh torpedo mode pa rin, okay? Torpedo mode pa rin siya. Hindi niya maumpisahan yung conversation until ayun nga, sinabi niya. Um uh, I like to return the favor call me. Here's a gift for you. White day ngayon eh. So, ganun. Oh, tontuwa naman si Komi. So, Paalam na si Tada, no? Komi tried on the gift now. Ano siya, parang uh, sort of a hand cream na na tingin ni Tada, no? E bagay kay Komi. So, tinrayin nga ni Komi. Ginoon niya sa hands niya. Wow! Yeah, nagustuhan talaga ni Komi. Right? Nagustuhan niya talaga. So, second story uh, involves the um, involves the game called Eraser War. Okay? So, Una, ang naglalaro lang sila Komi, si Najimi, si Tadano, uh, then si uh, Makiru. Si Makiru, silang apat lang. Eventually, the whole class, the whole class joined in. So, nagkaroon na big, <laughs> nagkaroon na big lang ng organized play. Tapos, may mga, may mga, may mga, may mga, Meron meron bang meron bang losers bracket na tournament na nangyayari doon sa kabilang kwarto, sa kabilang uh, sa kabilang side ng kwarto. Wow, right? Talaga. This story even had a JoJo spoof. Okay. It finally came down to to Komi. Kasi walang walang naka wala nakatipag sa sa main eraser na dapat nilang na dapat nilang uh, ipatumba using their own eraser kasi that's that's how the rules work for eraser war so it's Komi's turn na siya ang nakatumba sa eraser na yon. so well she's just been declared the overall champion of eraser war <laughs> at ganun siya ha? ha? ano nangyari? <laughs> the dust has totally settled everyone has uh, everyone has uh, has went home except for Tadano and Komi. Kasi nagpapatila pa sila ng ulan. Malakas nga eh. So, Tadano started the conversation with a, um, with an assessment of, of, uh, of the total makeup of Komi's circle of friends now. Right? Kumbaga, it's a, you can say it's a recap of the entire two seasons of Komi. 
Parang ganun yung nangyari dito eh. Eh, umentro na, umepal na naman si Najimi in, her, in his own usual way. In typical Najimi fashion. Final scene. It's actually a post-credit. Kasi, kaya pala nakapag-eraser war sila dahil eh, wala na silang ibang gagawin eh. They're just waiting for the closing ceremony to happen. So, ayun nga, nangyari na. Kumbaga, level up na sila. So, all of them now are in their final year of senior high school. So, eto na. Uh, new, uh, new school day, pasok na si Komi. So, tinignan niya, tinignan niya rin yung roster ng, uh, ng klase ng nak- nakabibilangan niya. So, at mukhang natuwa. So, uh, she now goes to her locker. Okay, papalit na sapatos. Okay, requirement yun. Then, of course, uh, nakita si Lowly ni Tata, no? Eh, sabi ni Tata, no? Good morning, Komi-san. So, ayun. Well, probably the most kilig parting shot ever to come out of Komi's mouth. Alright, ganito yung, ganito ang pagkakasabi niya. Alright, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll verbatim it to you as, as best as I can, guys. Here's what Komi said. I'm looking forward to another great year with you. Ooh! <laughs> Let's not get ahead of ourselves now. Bigo mga lifestyle. Let's break that finale down. Critic sub style right now. Base. Yeah, multiple stories. Ito naman talaga format ng Komi. The the for, the um the format Komi Komi can communicate is successful for. All right? Pacing, vintage slice of life feels, and of course the romance element. All right, yung ah, well, comic and community. This anime has been um has been really good at suddenly um pinching in those romantic moments between Komi and Tada, no? All right, nag nag naipon sila lahat ng romantic moments na ipon lahat sa season two. The finale is no different. Pero, <clears throat> that final scene, wherein, si Komi na mismo ang nagpakilig sa atin, wow! Alright? So, if that didn't lift your spirits, I don't know what will. The pacing is vintage Komi. Flow naman. Well, two stories. So, biggest gear shift of the first story was yung, um, was when was when Komi uh, when Komi was uh, trying to was trying to send her own father out to her own room kasi siguro naihiya siya kasi nandun yung tatay niya e eh, mag-usap sila ni Tada no and I think her I think I think her old man gets the point that's a gear shift folks okay for me bakit? kasi for someone who has a communication disorder, for yeah, for her to do that to to her own father, it speaks volumes now of uh of how vastly improved she is now, of how how much in control na siya ngayon sa kanyang communication disorder si Komi. The biggest gauge in the of the second story was yung uh yung pag-usap nila dalawa ni Tada no, wherein. Um, they were assessing as to how how Komi has um, how Komi's mission has uh, what you call this yung progress ng kanyang mission na na magkaroon ng isang daang kaibigan before she graduates from high school no brain of a gear shift there folks dahil you can now well, their closeness uh, the closeness between them is highlighted here kasi uh, sinasabi na ni Tada no kung ano yung mga personalities ng bawat kaibigan nila, yung bawat member ng circle of friends nila. And of course, uh, umaagree naman si Komi. So, but it all started when Komi said na um, they're going to they're going to have new classes next coming into the next coming into the new school year and she feels lonely right now. That's when this gear shift started. Bottom line of that gear shift is 
dito na highlight yung closeness ng dalawa right so much as to go, to talk about uh, talk to talk about the friends around them na ganun lang so akala niyo yung ano akala niyo yung post credit scene ng final gear shift nope this is the one so these two gear shifts that i saw definitely um panoorin niyo lang ang dalawang gear shift na to gets you na ang nangyari sa season 2 plot wise Need I say more? Planchado ang plot, mga ka-lifestyle, Bigo. <clears throat> the transitioning! There's that impeccable transitioning again by this anime. Talagang! Although it is the finale, wow, ay, nakasiguro ng OLM. Aba eh, lara ba natin butihin ang transitioning ng dalawang story ang to? It is the finale after all. So yun nga. Parang White Day. Uh, the first and second stories parang nangyari na lang ano yun. Eh. It only happened uh, a few days apart. All right. Pero hindi hindi rough yung transitioning eh. It's it's gonna make you feel na these two stories happened within the same day. Okay, I had those feels, mga kalaista, Bigo, when I was when I was watching this episode as of this recording. Kaya, well, only a well ironed out plot can can pull that off. Okay, the trend again. Wow, wala ako masabi sa transitioning ng uh, sa transitioning style ng anime na to. Talagang no slice of life anime can equal it. Not even K on. Okay? Doon yung transitioning, ha? Yung transitioning. So, pace, flow, and plot, they, they just simply came together for this finale, folks. So, Call Me Can't Communicate Season 2, finale, no-brainer. Two thumbs up! Okay. Pag-usapan natin ngayon kung babalik pa ang anime na to for another season. I'm putting the chance at 50-50. 50%. Bakit? Kasi, well, una sa lahat, walang teaser for the next, for the next run. Katulad nung, uh, like what happened in season 1. Then, there's a, there's a certain air of uncertainty in, in what Komi said. You know, I'm looking forward to another great year with you. So, well, bottom line, it's now OLM's call if they want to give this anime another season or not. Pero for now, thank you OLM for giving us uh, another great season of Comic and Communicate. You got a hit anime in your hands, boys. So, talagang, you, you deserve all the glory. You deserve all the thanks. Okay? My thank you isn't enough. All right. So what? So what else? Well, for all the hardcore Komi fans, yep, you, you got every right to wait on another season. Pero ako, hindi mo na ako aasa na magkakaroon ng isa pang season ang ang Komi. So in the meantime, there's well, there's another there's another OLM anime ongoing. It's summertime rendering, which is which is uh, which is also good. Okay, so do na ako focus. <laughs> it's another good, it's another good anime by OLM. Yeah, alam natin OLM. Yeah, they they got a re they got one of the most impressive track records in all of in in all of anime. Okay, so yano na lang. Okay, yano na lang, guys. So to the hardcore Komi fans, it's okay for you to to wait for to wait for another run at, for for. For another season. But for me, uh, hindi mo na ako aasa. Unless, unless OLM themselves tell me na, yup, Komi will be back. Yun. I'll be expecting much. So for, so for now, the final time, Komi can communicate season 2. Finale? Two thumbs up. And well, final two thumbs up for now for this anime, mga lifestyle. And probably for the final time, 
Kami, 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 kami. So we go. Wait for my next upload regarding the uh, the other animes in the roster that will be that will be ending this week. And for those of you who are still stuck on the CHD, ay nako. Mahala na kayo dyan. I'll just. Oh. I'll just watch it chill again. Enjoy this review, and I'll see you in the next one.